what we have here is an R formula question. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to shift 3 sine x over to the left hand side, which will give me a 4 cosine x minus 3 sine x is equal to 2. And for this, I'm going to apply the R formula. So I will let 4 cosine x minus 3 sine x be equal to R cosine x plus alpha. Expanding this using the trigger identities, this is R cosine x cosine alpha minus R sine x sine alpha. And if I were to now match the left hand side and the right hand side, we have a cosine x here and a cosine x here, which means that 4 must be R cosine alpha. This is going to form for me my first equation. And we have a sine x here and a sine x here, which means that 3 is going to be matched to R sine alpha. So R sine alpha, this is 3. This is my second equation. Let me try to solve for alpha by taking equation number 2 divided by equation number 1. So R sine alpha divided by R cosine alpha, this is 3 over 4. So RR can, can be cancelled, sine alpha over cosine alpha is tangent alpha. And this is 3 over 4, which means that alpha is going to be tangent inverse of 3 over 4. And this is equal to 0 0.64350. I'm going to try to solve for R. And to do that, I'm going to take equation number 1 square plus equation number 2 square. 1 square, it is going to be r square cosine square alpha. And here it is going to be r square sine square alpha, which will be 4 square plus 3 square. If I were to factorize out r square, I will have cosine square alpha plus sine square alpha, which is going to be equal to 1. And this that I have here is still going to be 4 square plus 3 square. So r square over here is going to be equal to 25. This will give me r to be equal to square root of 25, 5. So what I have now, this is going to be rewritten into this form where r is equal to 5 cosine x plus alpha is going to be 0 0.64350. This is equal to 2. And what the question one is for the coefficient here to be one. So I'm going to divide five over. So cosine x plus 0 0.64350. This is equal to two over five. And this over here is the alpha that the question wants. So alpha is going to be 0 0.644 to three significant figure. And this is the k. So k is going to be equal to two over five.